This video is how to modify any speedrunner's uh, game files. So first you need to go to the speedrunner's file. It's in your C drive, program files, Steam, apps, common, speedrunner's content. Any file within here you can modify using two tools. The XMB to PNG will be using this and GIMP to edit them. We'll be using that as well. Now first you need to find the file that you want to modify. Right now I'm going to modify that one to that one. Uh, Unic. Okay. Go ahead and get all those files, put them on the dashboard desktop dashboard right okay save that for later now this is your input so go ahead and grab all of those throw them in your input and then run the converter once it's done grab all these bring them out and open up GIMP now open all of these files. Alright, after that you can you can really do anything you want with the colors, but I'll just keep it simple. Bring the hue over on one, do the same thing with the other one same direction now keep in mind that you can change these colors to whatever you want you can change the brightness the contrast I mean you can make it do whatever you want you can go in here you can even invert the colors which makes it cool you can do whatever you want but after you are done you export them control E and yes, replace the file that is on the desktop. Once that's done, you can go ahead and exit out here, discard all changes. You don't need that shit. Now, you go PNG to XMB converter and convert all of these one by one. And this is gonna take a while. Go ahead and copy the name of it, right? and then you make sure that it's named the exact same thing when you convert it. There it is. Do that for all of them. All right, now that all that's done, you can go ahead and get rid of those. Open back up your folder that you copied everything out of. And you put all those back in. Replace. place. Now that it's all set up, you can go into speedrunners and try it out. Proof that it works. If you want to change these, I can show you that too in another video. Just let me know. And there's the head of the horrific looking green. Right, I use the blue one. There you go. So any any of those XMB files you can change. Just convert it into the image. That's also how you change the items. That's how you can change the the background. That's how you can change the the tiles. Like right there, the grapple. All of that. You can change every aspect of the game with what I just showed you. Have fun modding.